All right, welcome back to Dominion 6, turn 52. Uh, we're going to go through our messages. I'm back from uh, my trip home. Uh, Vano has cast At the Edge of the End Rainbow. We have found Dreamlight. Good. Uh, dark Knowledge. No new magic sites. Uh, summon Bears. Good. Uh, Firebird. Spectre. Augury. No new magic sites. Uh, Gnome Lore. No new magic sites. Uh, let's see, summon bears, very dire portent. Ariadu, god of Ermor, the harvester, prince of death, opener of the ways, has cast a global enchantment. Okay. Um, oh, our global enchantment was dispelled when another global enchantment was created. Okay, a dire portent. Uh, Helheim has cast... Uh, the Mother Oak, I want to say. Yep. Okay, um, let's see, uh, Korrigal, the Mage of Autumn, has searched Forbidden Fields for magic, but none were found. Uh, one of our crippled units died during the march to Cold Hollows. All right, uh, oh crap, they've attacked Manace. Okay, I'm not going to make it to that one in time. Uh, Chlad Caverns, what's happening? Uh, we did not catch them. So this is just going to be us against random PD. Okay. No big news here. Oh, wow, they actually bear transformed him. Who was that guy? Oh, well, he's dead now. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, we caught a few people, but nothing really meaningful. Okay. Uh, Manes, oh, give us a chance, please. Okay, we might still have a chance to take this. Uh, we're going to go in with a bunch of priests, and hopefully we can dispel these guys. Uh, their magic resistance is 12. She's ta taking out a whole ton of skeletons. What is she doing with her death spells, death gems? She's undead, diseased, and a limp, okay. She does have a heroic ability, precision, okay. Anything they can do to weaken this throne... So I don't think they're going to take it. So these guys here are shadows. They paralyze you. But that's about it. And then these guys steal your strength. Uh, <clears throat> it's a death weapon. Hmm. Okay. All right, well, they've got Kalasa routed. There went the most annoying cat in the world. I made a song for her today. She's a super annoying kitty cat. And then I annoyed my wife by singing it. All right, guys. How'd we do? Well, they've got an undead monkey now. Or three. All right. Well, I got rid of quite a few of the shades, a few shade beasts, and a few shadows. Okay. All right. Uh, there was a battle in the nether mines. Okay, they're moving up here, which is annoying. Good, we killed that thing at least. But nothing else. All right. A Leogriff one. <clears throat> All right, and then they attack me in Golm. 
This is the army that I want to wipe out. If possible. I'm not going to watch it because it's just PD. Okay. I'll have to take a look in a minute. Unexpected event in Might Marsh. Air gems plus three. Worldwide event has occurred. Heat plus one. Uh, we were attacked in Deep Wagor. That is a lot of... That's a lot of Buster Swords. All right. And our chieftain died. Okay. Um, we are under siege in Golm. Okay. That's fine. We are going to obliterate that. And then we will try to obliterate that. These guys are not going to pose a super big threat up here. They're just raiding. Okay, um, the first thing I'm going to do, guys, is uh, this button looks new, frankly. Okay. Um, so I'm going to go to my magic item treasury and show what I've forged from the last turn because it's kind of hard for me to remember everything. Um, but yeah, one thing I changed from last turn is I forged an extra Shroud of the Battle Saint. Um, that I'm going to put on one of my units. Anyway, um, we'll come back to that in a bit, but yeah, I just want to show what I'm forging in case I missed something what I'm describing previously. So anyway, see you after we have our turn planned out. Okay, we got our turn planned out. Uh, I'm going to start up here with my scout that was in the Hungry Sea. I'm moving him up into Waywoods. We're going to continue scouting up there. I am not yet ready to take on Manes. Uh I do want to get this group over here. I'm also bringing in this second priest. Um, I, I think it'll be okay. I don't think um, Kalos is going to come in with a bigger army yet. And then I'm pretty sure all of these guys and all of these priests will be able to uh, handily defeat Manes. Um, and we are continuing to recruit here. I'm getting some extra priests just for the extra banishments. And... Then here's Mother Oak uh, down here in Rus. We are getting another Daughter of the Sun and recruiting up Max troops. Um, we're going to get us Zeme here, continue casting Augury. We'll be ready for whoever pops their head up over here. Um, or we'll just take the fight to them too. Let's see. Uh, we are going into uh, Fenica with what we got. Um, this is the layout for our army. We're going to start out with Howl, then a Swarm, Fire Shield, Phoenix Power, Nest of Salamanders, Advance and Cast. Uh, so <clears throat> these guys have Spirit Form, so they are not going to take a buff like uh, Stone Skin and such. And I have transferred that over to Korrigal, who's going to start out with Group Stone Skin just to try to catch um, some of these guys that are... Uh, uh, not spirit form animals. Um, I kind of want the summer lions to be a bit close just so that they catch a buff from, I, I don't, I just don't want the heat to overly affect here. So we'll have the fire snakes about like that. That should put them far enough away from my guys who don't, who would be negatively affected by their heat aura, but close enough, hopefully to take on, take a buff. Um, or maybe the Summer Lions just get it. That's fine. Um, well, the Summer Lions can't take it. That's the problem, right? Uh, or they get it on our Chud Berserkers, which would be good too. Um, the Trolls are all going to be on Guard Commander. Just, that's their, that's their deal. That's their life. Um, I just need them to be a buffer against anything that tries to close with my mages. Uh, summon Earth Power, and then we're going to do Maws of Earth once to... Uh, I really shouldn't have these guys on him. Um, is there any other commander that would be better? No. No. Well, that's not great. And I don't want to mix my undisciplines. Hmm. Okay. Well, who would I rather have flee? Obviously, I would rather have those guys flee. So, yeah, these guys will just, they'll be on my weaker commander here. All right, anyway, um, hopefully something will be in range of Maws of Earth. It's got a range of 30 plus. Um, how much extra is it? Five for each extra, yeah, so he'll he'll catch some dudes in that. 
Soldiers of Steel, hopefully we'll catch anything up at my front line, or maybe, uh, I mean, it'll help those guys a little bit. Uh, and then another Maws of Earth, and then he's just going to do advance and cast spells. He's got bodyguards, so hopefully he'll be safe advancing. This guy's just bringing in an extra buffer of, of units. So he's he's stacked on top of here, so we should have trolls kind of surrounding these guys completely. Um, and then Chill Soul here, I actually don't want him there because he has a cold aura. Actually, though, these guys, these guys have cold resistance, not you. You do. Uh, you do not. That's going to be a little bit of a problem. I need you to stay back, actually. Shoot. Or maybe what I do is I put this guy... Okay, I'm sorry, guys. I'm just now catching this error. And then I'll put you here. Okay. So he'll be a little bit further away from the cold aura, I hope. Um... He doesn't have any heat resistance either. Well, oh, anyway, there's not much I can do about it at this point. Um, so, yeah, and I've given this guy uh, Dragon Helm, Sh Shroud of the Battle Saint, and Pixie Shoes, and he's also got the Skull Staff. So uh, hopefully he'll he's going to do Luck, Raise Skeletons, Invulnerability, Terror, and then just whatever spells seem appropriate. I don't know. Probably he'll just keep summoning skeletons, which is what I would fill in the last spot, but I'm going to leave it open for the AI to decide. This guy's casting spells. He does nothing except just, you know, have extra bodyguard. Um, yeah, so um, no conservative gem use on any of these guys, so whatever they have left, they should be spending. Um, we'll see how it goes. I This one, it's not as tough a throne as Manace. But it's still going to be kind of difficult. Um, there's the illusionary forces that are there, you know. I think we can do it. Um, we did get this preached up to four dominions, so she's going to be going in with 111 hit points. So that's good news. Um, yeah. she's Her max hit points is going to tank in the province. But uh, yeah, the point is to just keep her alive. The fire shield is just to try to take down anything that attacks her. Uh, okay. Okay. Research, he's moving. Um, let's see. Uh, continuing uh, to cast at the end of the rainbow. Uh, continuing to cast um, gnome lore. Uh, just research, patrol. Do I want to take that armor off of him? Uh, anyway, Sh Shroud of the Battle Saint. Um, and over here, what are we forging? I know I got somebody else forging. Nyr, nyr, nyr. Come on, tell me I'm not... No, not that. Nope, I have some people who are not forging. Okay. Um, what am I going to forge? I'm not going to forge nature at the moment. Um, forging a Shroud of the Battle Saint, which is... Oh, and I put that on... I put another one on Andre here. Oh, I know what I want. Um, well, for one thing, I want armors. Uh, for another thing, let's go ahead and get him... A, uh, I wanted to forge a skull staff, but I don't have enough death gems. So instead, we'll just forge up a uh, dragon helm. And uh, let's see, any weapons I want to put on that guy? I should give him magic weapons, actually. Um, what magic weapons do I have available? Uh, Herald, Lance, mm, not super stoked on... Mace of, Dis Mace of Fire, yeah, a Serpent Chris, Armor Piercing, gives Poison Resistance, um, yeah, okay, well, the Herald Lance would be nice, but it takes Astral 2, and I do not have an Astral 2 dude, um, I really ought to get some weapons, though, come on, so... Enchanted Spear versus Burning Blade versus... Well, I'm not going to do a Thorn Spear. Uh, I think Armor Piercing is good, but none of those are it. I would have to get a Earth Mage to do that, so let's get that off of there. He can still forge the Dragon Helm. Um, Flambeau is cool, but uh, Summer Sword 
two nature, one earth, and I don't have an earth nature priest unless I no, it takes two nature, is that right? Will this do it? And that would get us the summer sword. Um Okay. It's really more of a spellcaster's weapon in my opinion though. Um Shoot, guys. Well, there's the Sword of Sharpness. Let's just get a Sword of Sharpness. And we'll take the thingy there off. So he'll do Sword of Sharpness, and you can't forge anything for me, really. The Star of Darkness would be good if I had the Death Gems for it. Um, I'm going to leave it be, I guess. Um, all right, boots of stone could be handy too. Forge boots of stone. Okay, let's do it this way. Who is researching? Alright, so he's going to forge that. You're forging a sort of sharpness. Shroud of the Battle Saint. Uh, whoever's researching, just take... Yeah, so you're just going to take my random buffs for the extra mm, smidgen of research. Um, okay, I think that is the last adjustment there. Sorry, I missed it, guys. Um, these are my only dudes not moving. Okay, so let's take a look down here. Um... All right, we're moving on to Golem. Probably these guys are going to stay there. I don't know for sure. If they don't, it's likely these guys will move here, and then I will move and attack. Uh, I've put the uh, green Dragon Scale Mail on this unit to move and consolidate over here. I probably don't need to do that, really, because there's already... Yeah, I don't need to do that, because there's already a lab here. What's the point? He's just going to risk it, risk losing it in battle. So yeah, we're going to move down here into Golem and crush that army, hopefully. Uh, not putting any province defense here because th these raiders are just going to be able to do what they want anyway. Uh, and I did put a Boots in the Messenger on this guy for now, uh, just to increase his spellcasting endurance. Uh, you know, I had the extra one, so he's he's moving on to a lab anyway, so he'll be able to put it right back into the lab after he's done. Um, I don't think there's anything else really to cover. Uh, oops. That uh, keeps happening. Um, yeah, these guys are all going to continue to preach, except the one that, like I said, is bringing in the extra trolls. Well, it's going to be an eventful next turn, guys. Uh, as always, I appreciate you watching, but I think I'm going to add the next turn to the end of this video as well. So I will see you in a minute. Okay, we're back. It's going to be an eventful turn, and this is going to be a longer episode, so just a heads up, guys, at this point. Um, if I only release one episode this week, um, it's because this one went long. Okay, Conjuration is complete. Excellent. Um, we got a Zeme, a Firebird. We've cast Augury, no new magic sites, uh, Dark Knowledge. Oh, we finally found a Cavern Tomb. Oh, and that um, that Glamour site from before was just a one Glamour gem um, uh, prop, uh, magic site. Got a Firebird. Suddenly an arrow appeared out of the sky and struck... Sedilla, the Russian wizard, straight in the heart. He died instantly. Sucks. Um, no more. No new magic sites found. Uh, end of the rainbow. We found a singing tree. All right, good. Uh, Aspects, nothing found in Bay Pond. Uh, Firebird, bears. There is a battle in Waywoods. Good. Somebody... Okay, not good, because that is redonkulous. What is your bless? Tell me your bless. Bless yourself. I wish to see it. I probably already know it, but... Oh, wow. This, this dude's going to thug it. Going for big old thug time. Unfortunately, you just got hit with an arrow, so... Yeah, that didn't do you any good, did it? Yeah. 
I mean, maybe you could have taken out like 10 PD, but that was not 10 PD, was it? All right, there was a battle in Cold Hollows. Of course. Like going up against my 40 PD. Be wonderful if we could somehow turn this around, but I think we don't. I think we just lose all of our PD instantly. Yep, they all routed. Good job, guys. Well, that was a lot of money we just lost, but nothing much I can do about it. All right, uh, Fenica, we are attacking Fenica. All right, here we go. And I see somebody's attacking Manes. Oh good, you did do a blessing, I suppose, that's good. Okay, route them. Oh, you freaking fire snakes are already routing. That, this, this does not bode well. Really counting on those fire snakes to do some damage. Okay, well, we're taking out the vine ogres quickly. That's good. Our berserkers are unfortunately separated from the rest of the pack. Come on, try to save our Berserker. We got one Berserker. Oh my god, the Fire Elementals are out. Thank you, that extra Conjuration level came just in time. Because now there is no doubt in my mind that we are going to crush it. Oh yeah. Oh, that's great. <laughs> I was I was a little worried there, and then I saw the fire elementals. Okay. I mean, the fire the the summer lions also really were kind of the MVP there. Howl did some of its work. Uh, she doesn't have anything we can salvage though. All right, we don't care about the rest of this, do we? Nah. How do we do? Um, lost all of our berserkers, eight of our fire snakes, which I put on her as well. So they had the bonus um, defense. 18, 10 of them made it back. Yeah, we lost quite a bit there. Okay, let's see. Hopefully they don't take Manes. I don't want to be one turn too late. Okay, no, they're not going to take Manes with this much. Let's still see how much, see how they do. They're just draining this throne for me, and I'm totally fine with that. Unless, of course, they actually reinforce it by... By adding more undead. Mm, they didn't, they did manage to kill a couple of Shades and Shadows. Okay. Battle and Golem. Let's eliminate this army, please. Oh no, what are you doing back there? Definitely not intentional. That was not intentional. You're just a priest, okay. Oh, they got him. Oh, that's annoying, I really didn't intend to do that. Not sure how that happened. Oh, 
Not much to worry about there. Let's take a look at our wolves over here. Okay, so they are distracted by the wolves, which is good. But... God, those drakes are annoying. Alright, maybe we can get the cave beasts. We've caught up to them, thanks again to the wolves. Okay, we're getting rid of their annoying summons. We set fire to a couple of our guys. Well, they will lose everything regardless, so I mean, it's not like we cared. Lost the priests, Mbakimona shows, Chud Berserkers, and a Chud Warrior. Okay. But we should have eliminated all of them. Unless they managed to attack us somewhere else. Okay. Um, went through that. Bat uh, something happened in Forbidden Fields. A magic site sound found. Um, the evil that once laid waste to this land has awoken. From his dark fortress at the heart of the wasteland, the necromancer sends forth his minions to claim the land. Only the strength of faith will hold his dark power at bay. Okay, so finally that magic site popped up. We, you, re you will recall that I cast Dark Knowledge to try to find it, and I couldn't find it. Um, let's go ahead and skip to the fight here. Um, well, we have our fire snakes here at least. Oh, and they're retreating. Oh, you bums. You could have actually turned the tide of this battle if you hadn't retreated. <sighs> Shoot. Okay. Well, I guess we know where we're headed next. Um, unexpected event in Hidden Realm. Dominion minus two. Unrest plus eight. A large group of people have started to worship a false pretender. Uh, unexpected event in Kakivik, Kasivik Highlands. Nature gems. Excellent. Uh, verdant greenery. Oh, okay. Verdant greenery. Uh, that's a magic site that should be there. Uh, unexpected vent in light hills. An ancient treasure has been unearthed. Only 98 gold. Okay. Uh, the wooden fort in Terim is completed. We are under siege and cold hollows and our walls are damaged. All right. Well, let's check that real quick. Okay. Well, we will take them out. Um, that's all there is to add to that. Okay. Uh, well, let's go back here. Oh, real quick. As always, let's check our magic item repository. So these are the things I forged. I added a burning blade to my forge list because I thought, you know what? Let's just go ahead and give him two. This is going to be for our berserker that's going to go attack the throne. Let's give him two magic weapons so he can dice through those ethereal units effectively. Okay. Um, let's see. And then we found a magic site. Uh, where did we find it? Here's one of them. Cavern Tomb, just a death. And here we found a singing tree? No, no, no. Go to province. A singing tree. Two uh, of those. <laughs> okay. Um, we need to... Uh, we need to take this back immediately. Um, the Throne of Gaia has to be claimed. Okay, that's fine. Um, I do definitely want to get the Throne of Gaia, but unfortunately, we need to move back in and take this immediately. Um, so what was in here? A Bane Lord with his Bane Blade. Okay. A bunch of whites. I'm not concerned about the white. Well, they have Bane Blade. That's annoying. Maybe I'll take in some extra guys. Um... The Rushian Priest, got the Golem, Golem, Black Forest, Fenica. Okay. Yeah, we'll just go back in there. I'll probably take my prevent Pretender in there. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, let's go ahead and get on that. I will see you in a minute. Okay, we've got our turn planned out. I'm starting out here again with my scout, going deeper into uh, Helheim territory. These guys are going to be a problem. Uh, they're getting pretty big. Down here, uh, I am moving my... Um, Firebird Summoner over to Zabalba so we can start working on positive uh, events for Zabalba. And otherwise, researching. The other thing we're bringing in here is just some extra troops from Stanislav uh, just to try to bolster up. We are going to recruit a bunch of cavemen down here. This is what I spent the last of my gold on. 
Uh, over here, moving our scout into the nether mines. I don't know what they're doing over here, but we got to go take care of cold hollows, which unfortunately we lost all of our PD. That sucks, but I don't know what else to do, guys. We got to we gotta take out their armies, you know? Um, we built this one up. Uh, I'm not taking those two Bakemono shows because they're, what are they going to do? I mean, I guess I could take them. They'll just be bait for air dudes. Sure. Send them there. They'll get surrounded and killed instantly. Uh, let's see. Are we recruiting? We are recruiting more Bakemono show or show Bakemono, whatever. Bakemono shows. So maybe I don't want to do that. Maybe that is pointless to do. Eh, nah, we'll take them. They're chaff. They're meant to die. Um, and so they shall. Over here, our fortification, eh, it's okay. 220. So hopefully, yeah, I, I don't know. We'll see how we do. I don't think this was as big a force as the one we were originally contending with. I think we've got, I think we've got Pyrene exhausting their remaining resources. Okay, up here, we are going to crush Manes. Uh We are bringing in all of uh, our Chud Warriors are here. Um, it just interspersed with our mage core. These are just our priests. These are all the priests we're wearing, plus one over here. Um, and then this is a Thunder Priest, Wizard for enlargements. Um, and I've got these guys spaced out, so hopefully, even if they cast here, it'll it sh the first turn, it should catch the Chud skin shifters. But regardless, um, I've got these guys spaced out, so they won't be the main target for enchantment spells. Maybe I should move the skin shifters back one. Or up one. Let's do it that way. Okay, that probably will be better for spell targeting. I, I want them to target, you know, good units with uh, spells like Enlarge and so forth. Not like an individual crappy mage, you know, just because there's three of them in a tile. Which there isn't. I've, I've spaced them out. Our Grit Bears are at the back, so they'll start coming forward. Um, our Chud Hunters, they, I mean, they're going to they're gonna do what Chud Hunters do best. Um, right, Blessing and then just Spells, because I want them to start doing Banishments. But I do want to get our units blessed, obviously. Um, our exception is our Thunder Priests, who so I've got Misform, Blessing, and then Spells. I'll let them decide whether to do Lightning or Banishments. Um, scout doesn't matter. Uh, this guy is doing three Enlargements and then just whatever spells he can. If he can do Healing, that would be great. Um, I could have him Advance and Cast. That might be a little bit better. Okay. Uh, and then, yeah, just Spells. Spells, Spells, Spells. We're going to try to win this with magic and troops that will cut down the other stuff just by holding on. So these guys just got to hold on. And then our bears, they don't have magic attacks, but the fire shield should burn up um, those uh, spirits and such. Okay, um, that is it there. I really think that's basically it. We've got some forging going on. I'm not forging a lot, just a dragon helm and um, a boots of stone. I think those are probably pretty good. Um, continuing to cast no more and the end of the rainbow spell, which is being cast here for some reason. What? Forbidden fields. I don't think that's where you want to cast that. I don't think you're supposed to be able to cast that. Uh, let's try that again at the end of the rainbow. Okay. And then... Let's turn it on monthly ritual. Okay, I think that is correct. That, I, I don't think you can cast these spells successfully on a place that you haven't explored. Maybe it's just you can't target it, so it might have worked. But uh, yeah, and then Forbidden Fields, we're coming in here with what we have left. This should be fine. Um, it's just the Bane Blades. I don't want to get hit by Bane Blades. I put the... Um, oh, shoot. Just cast spells, I don't care. Um, and you too, just cast spells. I'm bringing in everything I got. Uh, yeah, and these guys are fine. Uh, cast spells, you can do some banishments. Spells, spells, spells. All right, doesn't matter too much. Um, Phoenix Power, Living Fire is going to definitely decide it for us. Um, I, I, there's just no way it can't work. So yeah, this is definitely going to be more than we need. Hopefully nobody's going to get any, you know, clever ideas about attacking this province. We are starting the fortified village. What's the defense of our province? I only put it at 10. We should be fine. Um, you know, they're all going to have to violate an app if they do it. 
Uh, yeah, we are going to need to kill Ermor before somebody else does. Um, in particular, Helheim. Uh, yeah, we got to do it. This is going to be a hard fight. If we get enough of our throne points, then, you know, we only have three. Um... Yeah, we only had three. The Throne of Guy will get us to five. Um, and then... I don't know what the last one is. It may be Throne of Beasts, but... If not, it's going to be the Throne of Life, which is going to increase our growth yet again. We're going to have some crazy growth in our uh, Dominion. But, yeah, this one's probably a level two or three because of the Titan that's protecting it. So this one's probably a level one. I'm going to... No, this is Throne of Gaia. That's right. Yeah. So we, we just need to get it. Um, yeah, really need to get it. Uh, but again, like I said, it's more important to me to grab this territory back before these guys get a clever idea. And I'm going in with enough, not because I'm afraid of what's here, but if there's a bounce, I want to win the bounce. Um, although I have a nap, so I, I don't know what's going to happen. If they take it first, then they kind of screw me, don't they? Uh yeah, if they take it first, that's really annoying. Mm. Yeah. Okay, well, we'll see. It, we have to take that risk. Okay, dude bro here. Um, I'll leave him. Just, yeah, I, I don't care about him. He can stay here and build a fort until we get ready to claim that. And uh, over here... We're not recruiting anything because we don't need to, and we have no money anyway. That's basically it, guys. That's what's going to happen next turn. Um, it'll be interesting to see. It's always going to be fun and exciting. As always, thanks for watching. Like I said, it'll be a while before the next episode just because this is kind of combining two turns. Um, but, yeah, I wanted to do it that way. Anyway, I'll see you next time. Until then, bye-bye.